attempting to avert an impending crisis that will affect the country's seafarers during the infancy of his administration. The president has shown his intent to help the sector, which serves as our best labor export. That's why it's not a surprise that he was guest of honor of the Philippine Merchant Marine Academy graduation rights today. Alan Francisco tells us more. Sino mag-aakala na isang taong tulad ko na galing sa lugar na tinatawag nilang squatter o informal settler ay mabibigyan ng pagkakataon na makita at sumaludo sa Presidente ng Pilipinas bago yabot ang diploma. <laughs> dahil sa inyo, natutunan ko na hindi lahat ng taong nagtagumpay ay dahil sa mayaman sila, kundi dahil ay nagtutulungan sila. He is Alan J. Humamoy, the class valedictorian of this year's graduating class of more than 200 seniors at the PMMA or Philippine Merchant Marine Academy in San Narciso, Zambales. Getting the family out of poverty and helping his sick father was his inspiration in studying hard. We were in the squatter, sir. They said they were in the squatter, sir. There were some rumors, sir, that they said they demolished our place, sir. With that, I worked hard, sir. I studied, studied hard to achieve the success I dream of, sir. Kaya ito na, natupad mo na at hindi ka nagkamali sa landas na pinili mo. Naging masaya ko kasi sa lahat ng pangarap niya, natutupad niya. Kasi lagi ko din sinasabi sa kanila na may kasabihan nga nagsasabi na kung ano yung gustuhin mo, matutupad basta gusto mo. President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr. himself witnessed the graduation as its premier guest of honor in this morning's graduation. President Marcos calls to all those who have graduated to help in maintaining the global stature of the Philippines in the maritime industry. Because the Philippines is known all over the world as a premier supplier of world-class seafarers. And to even improve the training of the Filipino Marines, President Marcos instructed government agencies to help the PMMA develop maritime education in the country. As your partner in improving the skills and capabilities of our people in the maritime industry, I call on all the concerned agencies to coordinate closely with the PMMA, facilitate what will make our maritime education even more responsive to the needs of the nation, while ensuring that whatever steps that we take will be in compliance with laws and regulations. The PMMA is a pioneer institution for maritime education in the Philippines, supported by government funding and also with help from the shipping industry. This academy is known for producing master mariners, chief engineers, shipping executives, naval and coast guard officers. The president also thanked the private shipping industry for supporting the PMMA. The government welcomes the private sector support in promoting quality maritime education and training that allows this industry to be more innovative, more resilient and adaptive to the ever-changing world. Alan Francisco, For the Nation, San Narciso, Zambales.